Hey everybody, it's Teen Girl 224 Robin. I thought that I'd come on and um, while I was working on a, some Christmas ornaments that I'm making for my tree this year, I'd show you how uh, how I was making them. Um, these are still wet, but um, I'm doing a candy theme, like whimsical candy theme. And these are some little cupcakes that I made. I saw some like this at, uh, they were a lot larger at Hobby Lobby and then my best friend Susie had sent me a picture um, because she knew that I was doing a candy theme as well um, of, of these cupcakes so I made some that size and then I made um, some this size like I said they're still wet but you get the gist of it so I thought that um, I would show you how I made them in case you all ever wanted to do a candy theme as well. So what we do is I'm using um, sorry for the crinkling. This is a three inch styrofoam ball. This is for the larger ones. And then this is about a four and three fourths um, inch circle. So you just take that and then we're going to need some fishing line. And this is a doll needle. You can find this at most uh, craft stores. This one's my old one. It's kind of bent, but they're really, really long. And they're called doll needles. Um, so you just, I need a way to hang my cupcakes on the tree. So this is what I'm doing. Just take and run it, run your needle with the fishing line through the center. And then with your end still on here, you take and Turn it around, but go over just a hair and take it right back through the other end to where it's like my, this needle. It's bent. Normally it would go through. There we go. Okay. And then hold on to this end down here because you don't want it to come back through. And so you'll have your loop up here at the top, and then you'll have your ends down here. And so what I'm going to do is just tie a couple of knots in the bottom. And be careful when you're doing this because your, your loop will pull back through if you're not careful. And they're loose, uh, they're loose knots. But if you pull on your loop and pull on your knots, it will tighten everything up. See, now I have a loop at the top to hang it, and I have my knot down here at the bottom. Why is it when I get on camera it does this? Okay. Okay, there we go. There's my loop and my knots. And so just go ahead and cut some of your loose scragglies scragglies off. And don't worry if your knot's not extremely tight because we're gonna glue right there anyway. Um, so I take him, I'm using my grid where I can kind of find the center uh, of my piece of felt and squirt a big dab just right in the center. And then ball on there and press down gently. Just enough to where, just enough to where you you can get that flat spot right there. Cause you'll see, see that's how my cupcakes are able to sit up straight, and that's more or less for storage. Um, so then what you do is you take and just do little gathers. 
And the easiest way to do that is to take and start doing halves of everything. Like so. And I'll try to do this really quick. Let's see how I'm doing halves. And then I'll do a half over here as well. And then I just keep going around. And I do like a half here, a half here, half here, until, oops, until, um, until you have one that's, you know, your little, your little cupcake holder. Looks more like a cupcake holder. And then I used Mod Podge with a, with a disposable brush and placed on there kind of like, you know, just randomly because the uh, seed beads are going to act as my sprinkles. And I put that on there just randomly. Don't cover the whole thing. And then I just put my seed beads just in an old bowl. And you just dip your cupcake down in there, roll it around. And then I also added this glitter. It's kind of thick, quite glitter that looks like snow. And I sprinkled that all over um, the top of it. And there you have it. I have some more um, candies that I've made um, that I'll show, show you later. But I thought that I would share this with you guys to where you could kind of see just in case that you wanted to make one or something. So anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good day. Bye.